The race for votes in the 2016 local government elections is underway, but it will be a while before we know the final result. In the meantime, the CSIR will be predicting who will win by analysis of statistical data. CSIR analyst Hans Itman explains that as soon as the results start coming in, they use that information to forecast how the rest of the people will vote. The CSIR can already start their predictions once 5% of the counting process has happened. It's really based on a statistical methodology that we use called uh, statistical clustering. So we divide the voting population into a number of groups. Uh, we've been using about 20 clusters where each cluster consists more or less of the same uh, kind of people, if I can call it like that. Another CSIR analyst, Saheed Kimi, says that you need training in applied mathematics and statistics to be able to construct a model to understand the data. And you need the computer scientist to, once you've written down the model on a piece of paper, to actually make it something that works in practice with real data in real time. I mean, the important thing here is that we're not after the fact, months after the fact, sitting and saying, this is what we would have predicted. We're doing it on the fly. Before anyone else knows, we're making a stab at saying what the final result is. Peter Smits, a principal researcher at CSIR Built Environment, explains that in the past elections they were a bit out with some of the smaller parties. However, with the bigger parties, they were within 1% of accuracy in their predictions. I think it will be in the metros, so quite a tough one, especially Chwani and, and, and Joburg and Nelson Mandela Bay. Uh, Cape Town most probably again DA, but um, it would be interesting to see how the model is going to uh, forecast, especially the effect of the EFF, because we got now EFF in to the process passed on 2014's elections and so on, so hopefully we will be a bit more accurate with the EFF than we have been in the past. Personal, I feel it's going to be the era of coalitions and uh, that there won't be an outright majority in one of the big metros, the three that I mentioned, but that's my own gut feel. And that uh, there's going to be some serious negotiations need to go on and I think that's a new phase in South African politics that um, we don't know, we are not used to uh, coalition politics like the Europeans and so on. Predicting the results of the 2016 local government elections is no easy task. But the elite team of analysts from the CSIR are confident that their forecast will come close to the end result. For SABC News in Pretoria, I'm Nina Wistosen.